have about an hour till dinner time and you need to know what can I make quickly that everyone is just gonna absolutely love? Well, I've got one for you. It's a quick, easy enchilada dish. Quick and easy. In this saucepan, I have two cans of cream of mushroom soup, Campbell's, and I've added um, probably a fourth of a cup of the jalapeno slices. This is gonna be my sauce for the enchiladas. This one I'm cooking one and a half cups of rice. The yield will be about three cups, I think. Gonna be using the Mission Carb Balance Flour Tortillas. Gonna be using the Tillamook Sharp Cheddar. This is an eight ounce package. I prepared this ahead of time. This is half a package of Impossible Meat with half a package of the sausage Impossible Meat. So it's a total of about 12 ounces of cooked meat. My first step is I'm going to add a little bit of the sauce mixture to the pan. My baking dish. Just to give it a little moisture so we don't want any sticking. Okay, and the preparation will be we'll have a scoop of meat. with a scoop of the rice. I'm gonna put a little bit of cheese on here. And then we're gonna put a little bit of sauce in the middle. And then we're gonna roll it up. And then we're just going to put it in our pan. Just like that. See? Can't see it. There it is. Okay, next. Next, we'll do one more. Scoop of me. Scoop of rice. Followed by the sauce. Just a day. The rest of the sauce will be placed on top of all these after they're prepared. So, round two, almost done. Roll her up. Roll her up. Tuck it in the pan, like right there. Right there. So those ingredients worked out pretty well. I made the eight burritos that were in that package. I've almost used all of the rice. I'm gonna put this in the pan anyway, what's left. Um, the soup, now I still have some left and this is gonna go on top of the casserole. So what's remaining here? So that was two cans of the tomato soup. I'm gonna spoon over the top of my casserole. Fair, trying to do it fairly. Spread her out, spread her out. I'm going to cook this at 375, 375, 350. You, you choose what works best for you. Basically, we're just heating this through and melting the cheese. All right, there's that. And now with the cheese. Let me go ahead and I'm going to put my extra rice here on this top. It's not going to hurt anything. I 
put it on the side, baby. Just kind of spreading it out. Out, out. There's not much left of it. I don't want no leftovers. We don't want no leftovers. This will taste good. And then top it with my cheese. This is the eight ounce bag I'm using. And we're gonna use all of it. It's about two cups of cheese. It's eight ounces makes about two cups. Okay, she's going into the oven. And I'll let you see it when she's done. Oh, this looks wonderful. 25 minutes at 375. Could vary if you did 350, it might take a half hour or more. You don't want it too brown. You see how cheese is melted and it's bubbling. This is good. It's all cooked. You're not starting out with raw ingredients. Here we go. Here we go. Taste test. Oh, the yummy. Oh, that is good. Mm -mm -mm. One more try. One more try. Oh, yum. Yum. Oops. Mm -mm -mm -mm. See how nice and juicy that is? 